Hector. I need that Hector. Let me get that Hector. Yeah, I need a. I need about a. I need about a hundred Hector's. Cruising around your city, yeah, just one night with it. Walking around real dapper, you know I'm nice with it. Living really lavish, and now they biting it. Talking about you have it, but really swiping it. Bro, bitch, ain't got no money. Tell the people um your name, where you from? You know? So my name one love dread. Um I'm from Seattle, but I reside in Atlanta. So I'm here. <laughs> How long you been out here? Uh I've been out here like six, seven years. Yeah, six, seven, eight years. Okay. The name though, your name, One Love Dread, I was curious about that. How did that even come about? Um, one love is like the one is like unique because my name is unique and it's one of one. So I got that from like one and then like the Bob Marley thing, like the one love, and then I, I got dreads. Like I always had dreads, so I just put all like all that together and got one love dread. <laughs> what like influenced you to start rapping? Is that something that you always wanted to do or something you just fell into? Um, I would say it turned. It was like poetry turned into music. So. Yeah, something like that. It, it, can, it should be good like that. <laughs> I guess so you used to write poetry? Yeah, a lot. Like, a lot, a lot. Long poems, short poems, all that shit. <laughs> so that was like, that was the reason why you started rapping or you just... I mean, that was that was part of the reason. And then just like previous situations, like, you know, dealing with people who was doing music and me seeing, like, trying to push them. And then not working, and then me having talent, like, just various things like that. So, I just got on the stage, and I got lit, and I ain't never look back. <laughs> okay, so it's being that you're a poet, too, like, do you write your music, or you just go in and freestyle it? Both. Both. Yeah, it's just, it really depends on how I feel. Like, sometimes I structure a song out, and I, I'll write it, and then sometimes I'll just be like, nah, I hear the beat, and I'll be like, nah, I got it. So, I go in and just kill it. Just either or how I'm feeling. Is it the process of writing it or do you like performing on stage? I like performing. I'll be a whole different person. <laughs> I'll be lit. <laughs> so it's like when you writing it, like do you feel the same way like when you're in the studio uh, writing your music? Uh, kind, nah, not really. Uh, okay. it's, it's different. It's like I'll write it. I'll write it. If I write a song, I'm going to remember it. So when I get in the booth, it's quick. Yeah. Like I lay it out in probably like 15, 20 minutes. And so, because it's like the song come out better like that. Like somebody told me, like you know, learn your song before you go in, go in the booth, and it'll sound like ten times better. Cause you'll know it. You won't have to stumble and like all that extra stuff. But no, nah, I, I think I like performing because I see everybody like they be bouncing it. That shit be getting me hyped. Like yeah. <laughs> hectos. Hectos. Why do you call hundred dollar bills hectos? Cause it's a new lingo, like. Everybody say hundreds, like everybody say dollar bill. You know, just I thought of a new term for for a hundred dollar bill, and I've never heard nobody say it. So I'm thinking, like, man, if I come out with hectos, like everybody gonna remember me off of hectos. Like, and it's a girl who hectos, like, yeah, like so. It's really just a remembering thing, and then it's just to get you know get somebody to be like, oh, that's one little dress. She got them hectos, like she did that, like yeah, so. I'll blow up, y'all gonna be like, heck those. Like, then everybody in the world gonna be like, heck those. And then, yeah, hundreds, fuck hundreds. It's heck those. <laughs> Maneuvering through this, like, this rap scene in Atlanta, like, how is it to you? It's interesting. Like, I see a lot of, a lot of different stuff. Like, I don't know, it's, it's crazy because it's like, you see the bad, like, you see the good. I just saw some, some messed up stuff, like, I'm still learning the industry too, so it's like I'm just learning as I go, but I'm just being cautious. Can't deal with fuck boys, man. You gotta move with caution. No, 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 no. Getting all these hectares, man. You gotta move with caution. See, you had me, but you lost me. Huh? Fuck nigga, try to double cross me. Me and my niggas move with caution. Yeah, me and my niggas move with caution. Got the power, no Austin. 
So try it if you wanna try it. Coming through and we flossing <laughs> Looking like young bosses yeah. Taking off like some rockets <laughs> Smoking gas, only exotic yeah. Now I'm getting all this money, money. Hector's coming by the bundle <laughs> Wildin' out cause I wanna yeah. But I'm still young and humble no. See these niggas pocket watching huh? Nigga better keep walking <laughs> Putting dirt on my name what? Now you snitching like a fuck nigga Bitch. Never thought you'd be a lame nah. Sorry that I even fucked with you Sorry. Now I'm doing big things yeah. And you trying to push up on me yeah. Niggas just want the fame what? But ain't that for the struggle Heart got cold down Mind got fall gas Black lines hate my it's, like, it's really a dirty game If you really get deep into it <laughs> What's the worst you've seen or came across? Um, shiesty people I, I wouldn't say that's the worst I just say like people People take a lot for granted Like with music or you know Stuff like that I mean, I ain't seen the worst of the worst yet, so like I said, I'm still learning, so yeah. I know there's more to come. I know I'm going to see way worse than what I already even saw. I just, it's people just, people crazy. <laughs> How you deal with it? Like, keep, I keep to myself. Like, I don't, I, I interact with a few people, like, you know, my group of people, like, I don't be just out there just socializing with everybody. If, it's, if I do socialize, it's about business, yeah. so it's strictly business. I'm not trying to make no friends out of this. I mean, friends do come along, but that's only the genuine one. So I just really key to myself, and you know, I work. So if you you trying to work, well, we can work. <laughs> okay. With that, is that, that's the song you pushing right? You're single. Yeah, with it, with it. Produced by Traumaton. It's going crazy too. Like I'm finna do the video. The video gonna get shot in Miami and Atlanta. It's gonna be dope. Like a lot of DJs, they fucking they, they messing with that record. Um, so yeah, like it's it's really it's growing on people. Like they cruising around your city, like they fucking with that shit. <laughs> <laughs> so other people like where they can get at you at, like all your social medias. Everywhere you can find me. Everywhere, just type in one the number one L U V dread. Like everywhere, type me in. I'm there. You gonna find me. <laughs> just like that. I'm lit. Like they know just like magic. Oh, I got money problems, I'm an addict. Wanna, wanna, wanna address? Man, I'm living this work. Wanna, wanna address?